Cancer, what's up? Welcome to my channel. Am I tripping or not, Tarot? My name is Cock Frost, but you can call me the Ghetto Nun. So, Cancer, I'm here to do your September slash general slash love reading, my G. I do cuss in my readings and give no fucks about it, so if you do, please get the fuck on. I do start all of my cards upright in my deck. I don't believe in starting out with reversals because that's some bullshit. Also, I did pre-shuffle Cancer, but I did not lay any cards down just yet. We're going to do it together. Please keep in mind this may or may not resonate with every single cancer. Get no fit nugs. Info for private readings will be below the video. Please take the time to check out our community board. It's like the farmer's market for all the nuns and high priests where they have their businesses, purposes, gifts, etc., etc. posted. If you'd like to submit your business for the bulletin board, please check the info in the description box below the video, but it is currently under construction. If you find that the convent is not for you, please look for the nearest exit mark. Get the fuck on. Watch your head on the way out. Hit that You'll be back in Tarotland. Thank you to everyone for all the bookings, donations, likes, subscribes, comments, shares, purchases to my website, and pledges to my Patreon. I love you. Cancer Booski. What's up, G? Cancer, I feel like in uh, September, you guys may be uh, unintentionally being like nosy. Like you may just see shit going on. You're going to keep quiet, Cancer, but I see you peering through your blinds or peering through your windows and seeing something go down. Or this is someone watching you, Cancer, okay? Some of you guys just work in the medical field. I see someone like peeking out their office and like it's a full waiting room out there is what I heard. So if you're in the medical field, Cancer, uh, it's going to be busy in September, boo. Okay, cold season, flu season, Rona season, I don't know. Okay, sick season shit. Okay. Uh, something about beautiful night skies, Cancer. The nights may be... Uh, really beautiful where you live like warm summer nights or something like that the stars the moon all of that you may be stargazing or moon gazing in september or shit you looking at another cancer or aquarius or something like that possibly a pisces or you could have this in your chart cancer some of you guys may be looking for a new car new job i feel like you're in search of something cancer you know like wishing up on i'm wishing on a star Boom, boom, to follow where you are. That's what I heard. I'm wishing on a dream. Okay, Cancer, what you wishing for? Uh, I heard happiness, Cancer. It sounds a little cheesy, I ain't gonna lie, but I know you really mean it, though. But if I were to ask you, well, what is happiness, Cancer? What is happiness to you? What would you say, Cancer? You know, I don't feel like you could really explain it right now. You just know you want to be happy or you know you want happiness. So I feel like cancer, what they're saying is you may need to be more um, detailed in your prayers in regards to what you're asking God to bless you with or whatever you're praying for. You may need to be a little bit more detailed and make sure it's for your highest good and the good, highest good of others. All that, sh and it's pleasing to God. Absolutely, they say, yeah, and it's pleasing to God. All those things need to be in alignment with whatever you're praying for in order for you to receive them, okay? Somebody also knows a secret about somebody, Cancer. Either uh, you know a secret about someone or someone knows a secret about you, but I feel like your secret is safe is what I heard. I don't feel like anyone's going to tell this secret or anything. It's a The secret is safe, okay? So I don't feel like you really have to worry about it, Cancer, but someone may be prying or looking, though. So somebody knows he Cancer, okay? They are. Let's see here. Give me some messages for Cancer in September. What's going on with them now? with cancer what's going on with cancer Oop, that one flipped right over cancer uh, i'm gonna take it vertical because that's kind of how it came out this is everything on the table this is like headline news uh frontline news things like that this is like uh overspending as well cancer this is putting everything out there is what this is so be careful of overspending but i do feel like something may be trending as well cancer so this could be a business, this could be what you do. Something you're doing or something someone else is doing is trending. It could be a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Uh, you could be releasing something soon, opening something up or presenting something, a project, pictures, music, book, whatever. I feel like something's gonna be trending soon. Uh, Cancer, it could be you. This is something getting like, uh, not necessarily released, but it's already out there is what this is, Cancer. So maybe put your intentions out there. Set your intentions, I heard. Yeah, but the xylophone is not here. So whenever these uh, sticks come out and the xylophone is missing, because it is, the sandwich is reversed. Well, these, this whole deck is, but yeah. But even still, the sandwich is still, 
It's not the xylophone G, okay? So basically that's the high vibing part that's missing from this equation here. So this is like um, asking for something, but it's missing something. It's like you can't, you don't need these without the xylophone. Like what's the point of having them? So there's something I feel like you're missing, Cancer. I feel like it's right in your face too, whatever it is, okay? Uh, they said whatever it is you're missing is at the forefront of your mind. So that's kind of weird because it's like I'm sure you're looking for it, but they're saying it's at the forefront of your mind. So it's right there. Whatever you're missing is right under your nose, Cancer, or something like that. Or whatever you're looking for, excuse me, is right under your nose, they said. Give me another one here for Cancer. So this is the being stuck card, Cancer. You could be dealing with a Taurus, uh, a Pisces, or an Aquarius, like I said earlier. I heard if it's up, then it's stuck, Cancer. You know what this feels like? Something you can't take back, Cancer. Something you can't undo because it's already out there. So this is like uh, a picture on the internet, a video or something, and it's out there. It's stuck. Like they say, once something comes out on the internet, it's out there. Or this could be like once you tell somebody something. It's something about a secret here, Cancer. This could be coming out about your job as well. Or I could, or I see you guys doing promotion for your job. Like So you could be, I don't know, making flyers or creating a business page or something on social media. Uh, some type of promotion or something like that, Cancer. I do see that in regards to business. If you're a tarot reader, I feel like you're putting it all out there, Cancer. For real, for real. Like, I mean, you're you're good, but you're exposing a lot. Or somebody is heavy on this Taurus here doing this shit. Uh, if you're a tarot reader, not like you're doing this shit, but I mean, as far as shit, you, you the shit. I mean, you telling on everybody is what it has said. I don't know. Or something's being released about a Taurus, uh, Cancer. Something may be coming out about the military or some shit like that. This is kind of uh, worldly for you, Cancer. It doesn't feel personal yet. I mean, even though it's a zodiac, it's a collective Cancer reading, but it still doesn't feel like it's personal for Cancers yet. So let's, I don't know yet. Something's definitely going around about somebody, Cancer, for sure. This is definitely giving me rumor energy that someone cannot dispute, take away, or something like that, G. Okay? This could be someone also, uh, like the news of a child, and it gets around. You know what I mean? And everybody knows somebody got a baby. Everybody, This is like something being known, Cancer, in September, okay? I hope it's good news. Put something on this uh, four of pinnacles all out there. Uh, King of Swords, yeah. It's something about something that's gonna be seen, Cancer, or read, or watched, or something like that. This is giving me like, uh, social media, TMZ, World Star, uh, some shit like that, Cancer. This is giving me rumor energy for sure. Uh, you definitely could be dealing with an Aquarius here with this two on this stamp, and then you got the King of Swords. So definitely Aquarius energy out here, Taurus here when you, uh, with that five and these cookies here, uh, or Pisces here with the three. Side note, if you have Virgo in your chart, Cancer, you look really good. Or air in your chart, you look really, really good. There's somebody, and you're a female watching, there's some man looking at you, girl. I feel like this man lives in your neighborhood. If you jog or walk or do any type of exercise outside, Cancer, walk your dog or anything, there's somebody that watches you. So be careful with that shit, okay? I do see a stalker out here. Not necessarily, well, they got their eyes stuck on you. Cancer, are you watching somebody? Somebody watching somebody hard as fuck. They can't take their eyes off this person. I just can't tell if it's someone could be being followed. Like I said, it's giving me like a uh, private investigator energy. Oh, that's what it's really giving me. Uh, like you can't dispute something. Like so somebody could be taking pictures. I'm hearing surveillance or following someone, Cancer. What the hell? 
Yeah, somebody's trying to figure out where someone lives, who someone's sleeping with, all this shit. Especially if you're dealing with an air sign, Libra, Aqu heavy Aquarius, or it could be Gemini, okay? Somebody also thinks about reaching out to you, Cancer, or you think about reaching out to somebody and just putting it all out there on the line, like just telling somebody how they feel, but then they get stuck. So somebody wants to reach out to you uh, and say a whole bunch of shit, but they know whatever they say would be kind of, it, it's either petty, Cancer, or you're going to feel like it's childish, like, well, what the fuck are you calling me for, is what you would say, or why are you telling me this, or, or someone would say this to you, Cancer, so basically like, and, and they'd be stuck. Because it's like it doesn't go anywhere after something else. So it's like someone telling you something, then you responded to them cancer, and then it's like, or you ask them a question, and then they, they can't answer that question. And they don't want to get to that point of the conversation, so they just don't call you at all, or just don't respond, or just don't say something at all. Whoever this is, cancer, is really disappointed that they're this way. It could be another water sign, or like I said, an air sign. So cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, that feels this way. Some of y'all work at the post office, Cancer. Or like I said, you're in the military or something. Put something with this stamp here. Why is this here for Cancer in September? Just this car, yeah? You could be dealing with the Libra as well. Libra, Aquarius, energy out here, heavy. Pisces, Taurus, okay? Uh, could be Gemini, Capricorn, Virgo. Or you could have that in your chart. Uh, somebody feels stuck in a marriage, uh, cancer, okay? You or someone else are in a relationship with somebody. I feel like somebody really wants to tell the other person, like, I want a divorce. Because this somebody saying, I want a divorce, just putting it all out there. So maybe, oh, so it could be cancer. You or someone else could be a Libra, uh, Aquarius, or Gemini, or somebody. Somebody out there has been talking to someone, cancer, like uh, confiding in someone and letting someone know, like, you know, I think I want to divorce. I think I want to separate. So this is either you, cancer, telling someone this or someone telling someone else this shit. I think I want to separate. I think I want to quit. I think I want to divorce. I think I want something, right? Whoever someone is telling is telling every motherfucking body else, cancer. Somebody out here telling all you business or is you, G? Period. So you know for uh, for certain that this gets back to someone. So if someone went and confided in their friend and was like, man, I think I want to divorce Kathy and shit, right? Uh, they went and told the friend with the big mouth. So then the friend with the big mouth, somehow it gets back to Kathy that you want a divorce or that someone wants a divorce. Something gets messy out here, Cancer. Be careful who you confide in, Angie. Okay? Somebody's, uh... Somebody's, uh... Conversations are not being kept confidential here, Cancer, in September, for sure. I don't know if this is a lawyer, because this definitely supposed to be some, like, lawyer, uh, client, something. You know, confidentiality and some shit going on. It's a lawyer out here talking, uh, Cancer, or is you, uh, somebody talking about a case, or some shit they ain't supposed to be talking about. And it spreads like fucking wildfire, Cancer. It does. So be careful who you telling your business to, or Libra, Aquarius, uh, Pisces could be Gemini. Be careful who you, or Cancer. Be careful who you're telling your business to, G. Something also gets released, like some uh, sealed court, court documents or something like that, Cancer. They get released to the public, or it's now public information. Or someone could be going through someone's records or something, background checks. Get, what the fuck, Cancer? Somebody out here is spying on somebody, too. For some of you, Cancer, it's you if you're grouped with an, um, uh, another, uh, if you're grouped up with someone, Cancer, it's you watching somebody. If you're not grouped up with anybody, Cancer, you're like, no, I'm a lone wolf, I do shit by myself, then there's somebody watching you. And they probably watch other people too. They just fucking watch people. A people fucking watch her and shit. I don't know. Some of you guys may be getting invited to a party, Cancer. I'm seeing an invitation out here. or some, It may be a divorce party. Uh, is what I'm picking up on. Someone is going to stick with the divorce or stick with their lawyer. So someone may have thought about backing out. Like, oh, maybe I don't want to get a divorce. Maybe I don't want to separate. They stick with the shit. Someone's like, no, nah, I'm going to stick with my end. I'm, I'm going to get out of this shit. I'm divorcing or I'm separating or I'm getting a lawyer or some shit like that. Maybe this is why this person cancer tries to put it all out on the line. This is like someone trying to stop someone from divorcing or separate from them like okay i'll tell you everything i did this i did that i love you i this i that and somebody's still like well thank you for telling me but i'm still on a divorce 
Yeah. I feel like it's a woman. There's an angry woman out here uh, that wishes they could be with someone else or an angry man. So I feel like that's really why someone wants... So look here, Cancer. Say you're with somebody, right? And you or somebody's with somebody else. I don't know. But say these two people have been having issues and one person's like, I want a divorce. And the other person's like, no, I don't want a divorce. I want to work it out and all this other shit, right? And the other person, like I said earlier, is like, nah, I want to get the divorce. I'm going through with it. The person that's like, no, nah, I want the divorce. I'm going through with it. This person has somebody as well. Okay, I hate to put it out there, but they do. So it's almost like uh, this person here, this King of Swords energy, whoever this is, could be like, let's fix it. You know, like trying to appeal to this person and thinking like, maybe it's me. Maybe I can fix it. Maybe it's this. We'll go to counseling. We'll do this. And this person's like, no, I still want to separate. I still want to divorce. I still want to quit. It's because they have a second second option somewhere, Cancer. You with somebody else. Okay? So somebody may not be telling someone that. So somebody may be like, well, I don't understand why they don't want to fix it or, you know what I mean, stay or something like that. It's because someone or something uh, got a, a second something. Okay, Cancer, if that makes any sense, G. Go back to this King of Swords because I feel like this is you here. Put one with this King of Swords. Why is this here for Cancer? Six of Pentacles with the Seven of Pentacles came out. What's that break down to? to the Four of Pentacles, I think. Shit, don't give me the counting. Yeah, four of pentacles, which is the four of pentacles again. Yeah, somebody really wants to hold on to something. Heavy Taurus out here, uh, Cancer. It could be a Capricorn Virgo as well. Someone's trying to fit, like figure something out, come up with a plan. Like, I, I feel like this is like, I'm willing to do anything. You can have kids with this person or somebody has kids. They're like, I'm willing to do anything. Let's fix it. Let's do Somebody really wants to work something out with someone, Cancer, and somebody's like, no. Okay, I'm leaving this job, this marriage, this something. This is the fire. This is the hierophant here. This is somebody definitely separating here or going through some type of court or legal issues. But it really, well, it damn sure could be in regards to work. Uh, and somebody may be trying to get you to settle cancer. You're like, no, I'm still taking you motherfuckers to court. I ain't settling shit. It's like somebody got their mind made up, but it's because they, they have something in the bag. So if it's a, a you're suing a job, it's like your lawyer has convinced you, like, no, nah, we can win this shit. So you'd be like, no, I'm not going to settle. I'm taking this shit to court. If it's a divorce type of thing, separation thing, and someone's like, well, we can work this out. We don't have to divorce or get separated. Somebody's like, no, nah, I'm divorcing and separating. They have someone they want to be with now. It's like someone has a, a whole nother life or something waiting for them just on the other side. Cancer is what I had heard. Okay. Somebody also out here knows somebody is planning to do something, Cancer. Heavy Capricorn Taurus Virgo, uh, Aquarius Gemini, or someone knows what someone is planning to do, Cancer. They've been watching someone. Someone also could be watching you at work, Cancer. It could be in a good way where they offer you something. Like, you know, we want you to stay at the job. We'd like to offer you the management position or some shit like that. I do see someone being offered a, a, a higher position at their job, but they've been watching you work for sure. How you work with others uh, and all this other shit. Somebody's also coming up uh, for a performance review soon. I don't know. You know they're going to have shit on there to say about you, Cancer. What you need to fix and shit you didn't even know about. They have to find something to say wrong about you, Cancer, or a, or a cross watcher. It's me. I always got written up with something wrong and shit. But that's what this is. Even though they know you're a good worker, you're focused, you're on time. Uh, you're committed to your job and everything. They still gonna ding your ass, Cancer. Just motherfucking because, G. I don't know. Just because they gotta ding you and shit. Um, wrong deck. Where's this other one? Here we go. Put something on the... What was that again, Cancer? Oh, yeah. Uh, headline news. So some of y'all, yeah, it could be a promotion where, you know, they send out the email. Oh, we'd like to congratulate Cancer for being the whatever, whatever employee. We've just promoted them to whatever. Say congratulate. You know, it could be something like that going around Cancer. But you don't really look too happy here with this justice card. It could just be that it's more work involved, Cancer. You know what I mean? Or I do feel like it's a lot more on your plate as well when it comes to work. Work is definitely steady and busy, Cancer, for sure. Especially if you work in financing, the medical field, real estate, uh, the post office, uh, in any type of legal field, all types of shit. All that shit booming. 
Okay, the airport, TSA, all that shit booming in September. So I see job security out here, Cancer, for sure. Put something on the headline, King of Swords, Seven of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. Why is this here for Cancer? Whitney Houston trying to come out. Yeah, that was my and I will always love you card. So yeah, somebody's like trying to save a relationship. I'm telling you, look at this man here, Cancer, in this green turban or whatever he has on. Don't he look like his mind made up no matter what the lady's saying? So she could be like, I really love you. Let's work it out, whatever. He's thinking like, I can't wait to get to my real person. Like, I can't wait to, it's like someone's like already like, uh, you know how they say like people, um, uh, like respond, but they don't listen. It's giving me this type of energy. It's like, uh, like, you don't have to finish talking, Kathy. I'm already leaving. I've already got the lawyer. I've already signed the paper. It's like this type of shit. And she's like, but you haven't even listened to what I tried to, like, this type of shit, okay? It's like somebody has got the king of swords always have his mind made up. Gee, it's hard to change his mind. Uh, Diana Ross, the drama card came out. Well, that could be why somebody cool. Shit. Somebody also works in, like, uh, like I said, TMZ. It could be media takeout, world star, something with tabloids, shade room, something like that. Somebody's like a journalist for, like, like, like gossip and drama though i don't know i also see you guys reading this shit cancer so you are up on the trending news whether you don't want people to know that you know what's going on you do okay or you're in the in you got your ear to the streets or something something about you guys watching something online some of you guys could be taking uh classes online cancer i see that as well a lot of eights out here so 888 could be significant. Some of you guys work in a call center. Can It's drama like a motherfucker. If you work in a call center in September, it's going to be some drama at that bitch. You damn sure going to be called in the office there, Cancer. Or any type of uh, job where it's like uh, a bunch of people working in one room is going to be some drama in September. You can believe it, okay? Something's going to come across like it's headline news, Cancer. It's, this could be local, though. So something in your town, something in your state, something in your city in September, something's going to be like breaking news, G, okay? In your town, city, or state. It could be good news. Uh, somebody could be, you know, I hope it is, shit. I don't know. This could be like an inmate escape too, so I don't really know cancer, but I'm, I keep getting headline news. Somebody lives on, on Pearl Street, I heard, or this could happen on Pearl Street, or someone stays on Pearl Street, or Beach Street, I don't know, or Beach Street, I don't know, somebody could be a cop out here as well. But somebody is definitely sharing information with someone else, Cancer. Someone's getting intel on someone and sharing it with someone else. I feel like someone got a private investigator out here, Cancer, to watch somebody. Now, this could be a private investigator that was that was hired to watch a, a spouse that someone's about to go to court uh, with in regards to divorce or child custody. But somebody damn sure being watched out here. If it's not like that, then somebody's just watching someone, like surveilling them, like just every move they make, Cancer. I don't have your energy out here, G. I got everybody but your ass out here. Uh, and yeah, I don't really have water out here. I have air, earth. Uh, oh, I don't have fire. Oh no, and fire, eight of wands, yeah. Some of y'all work with somebody whose name, whose name is Diana. They never shut the fuck up, G. They just talk. They know all the gossip, all the business, everything. Some of y'all need to be careful who you're confiding in, Cancer, or just what you're doing out in public, possibly, or just watch your surroundings, because damn sure someone's being watched by someone else. Now, Cancer, if it's not you being watched, someone could be suspicious that you're doing something, uh, and you could be being watched. You're just not involved in something. So let's say you're a, a suspect in regards to something, Cancer. I don't know. Somebody is watching you to see if you're involved in something. If you're not, you have nothing to worry about. But if you are Cancer, they're going to get evidence on your ass, okay? So I don't. they're going to be like, is this you? And they're going to show you the video and you're going to be like, that, that damn show look like me. It do look like me. Somebody going to get caught red-handed, Cancer, okay? In September, G. Something about uh, someone getting arrested or like a divorce or something that's going to like 
be like major to people. Like like people will be talking about it, cancer, okay? Again, this could be worldwide, this could be citywide, this could be neighborhood wide, statewide, I don't know. But it's something that's gonna come across your TV screen, your phone in September that you're gonna be like, wow, G. Fucking wow, G. But you, whatever this is, you knew it was coming. Or you could feel it coming, or it was just a matter of time before this got exposed, this came out, or some shit like that. So if you've been on the up and up cancer, then you have nothing to worry about. This just gonna be some shit about someone else, and you just gonna, you know what I mean? Read all about it, type shit. Yeah, paper boy is what I heard. Do the ditty if you want to, because then I can see if I want you. Damn throwback. Down, down. Something about paper boy. What's that shit called cancer when y'all buy houses and fix them up and sell them? I see that going on. Let's just call them fixer up our homes, okay? I seen somebody uh, buying homes, fixing them up, and selling them cancer, okay? In September. They real fucked up too, okay? I feel like some of them just got to be torn all the way the fuck down. Or someone's tearing down some buildings or some development and putting something else there, uh, cancer. This could be happening in your neighborhood, uh, something about voting and council meetings and all this other shit. So I don't know, you could be on the city council uh, board in your neighborhood or some shit like that, Cancer. I don't know what they talking about, okay? I know that motherfucker messy too. Whole lot of rumors and drama going around about them people. It's something coming out, Cancer, okay? I I'm going to ask if you're in the middle of this shit, but let's put one here real quick. Pulling on this stamp here with the justice. Joni Mitchell never lied. Whatever it is, it's true to the motherfucker too, Cancer. It's like somebody being questioned, interrogated, or there's surveillance, proof, receipts, cell phone records. It's something that you cannot dispute, G. Especially with this stamp here. Whatever this is, sticks. Like you can't, uh, so this is like somebody confused. Like, I don't know, I'm not sure. This is like somebody being set up for something, Cancer. Uh, but to tell a lie when people already know the truth. So it's like, were you here at this time or were you with this person? And somebody's like, no, I wasn't there. Like, you sure you don't know this person? You were not there. They're like, I'm sure. I'm, I'm, I wasn't there. And then they show them the shit, G. Or have proof or something. And look at her face. Joni Mitchell never lied, but this motherfucker do. Like, yeah, we caught your ass. You stuck. Ooh, we. Heavy Taurus out here in trouble, G. Uh, for sure, for sure. And Aquarius. I don't know what they up to, Cancer, but them motherfuckers in trouble, G. Something to do with some money, okay? It's a lot of it out here. Motherfuckers go down to two of pentacles at the end. So someone out here does get stuck with some type of, uh, like they have to pay somebody back. Someone loses in court where they owe somebody, uh, Cancer. So I, I am picking that up too, okay? Yeah, somebody walks away clean, scot-free. It could be a Virgo Leap or Cusper uh, that wins or you cancer or something. But somebody out here uh, gets caught for sure. Let me find out what the fuck this rumor is, cancer. What the hell going on? Side note, where is cancer in this and what is the rumor? What's going to hit the headlines? Ace of Pentacles. Something about people wondering where somebody got some money from or how somebody got something, Cancer. Yeah, somebody, so this could be the fucking IRS with they ass. Audited motherfuckers and shit. I see that shit here too, Cancer. Or uh, something about loans, PPP loans, refinancing, mortgages, all this shit, Cancer. Somebody about to get in trouble for that. There's uh, receipts, there's, paper, there's a paper trail, Cancer, okay? How is somebody able to do all this, purchase this, get this, have this, is what this is. Somebody wants to know what the fuck is going on, and they're going to decide to look into some shit, okay? Or this is a boss at a job, somebody been stealing, or numbers aren't correct, someone's clocking, shit is off. Something's off here, Cancer, and someone's being watched in regards to it. They ass going to get caught in September. Fuck, yo. They are. Ooh, hey. Where they get the money from? So, Cancer, if you got a lot of earth in your chart and you know you've been in, involved in some Bernie Madoff shit, you in trouble, okay? Especially if you got Taurus in your chart, G. Uh, shit, now. Could be Virgo, Capricorn, Heavy, Aquarius, Libra as well. But damn, 
okay? It has something to do with uh, work and other people involved. This is a collaboration. It's more. It's a lot of people gonna go down, but somebody gonna flip on somebody for sure. They gonna uh, get the weak one first, Cancer. Whatever you involved in, I don't know. Somebody's gonna break. Ooh, wait, what's up? What's this whole shit? Bernie done made off with somebody motherfucking money, okay? Here. Or Bernice have. Yeah, her work weekend at, weekend at Bernie Madoff's, they said. That's fucked up. Damn. Not weekend at Bernie Madoff's. Somebody that stole some money here, Cancer, from somewhere. A business, uh, some property, uh, some investment property, uh, some something. Investment something, G. Okay? They've been doing some illegal shit with paperwork. Uh, all type of shit. Somebody has a government job where they've been for dangling names and titles and social security numbers and all type of shit. And they gonna ask this person, were you for dangling names, paperwork, social security numbers and all this shit? Right? And this person gonna be like, no, I was not. They gonna be like, are you sure you were? They gonna be like, no. And they gonna pull up all this motherfucker login shit, everything. Uh, cancer. Look, muddy waters. What you mean? No, what me? What you mean? I'm telling you, somebody gonna play the whole dumb nigga role. They are, excuse my French, but they are. This that I bought the bottle of beer type of shit. Okay, if you know what I'm talking about. Put one on this Ace of Pentacles here. Why is this here for uh, cancer in regards to what the hell? That one flew on the floor. Yeah, somebody knows something coming. They can feel it. I believe. Yes. Somebody gonna be Ray Charles to the bullshit. I ain't seen nothing. I ain't heard nothing. I don't know nothing. Uh, yeah, nah, this is the type of shit. Okay. Somebody gonna be stuttering this shit. We got fire out here now, but this is somebody who got, uh, this is like the scapegoat cancer. This is somebody who got, uh, you know what I mean? Like me? They said I did it, Yana. Oh, no, 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 Yana. I wasn't the one that did it. See, what had happened was. Yeah, somebody gonna tell on somebody, G. Whoever the one is that tells is uh, this person is either backed up into a corner cancer or they've been uh, like they have no more fight in them. So this is somebody that's scared, uh, threatened or some shit like that. It could be with divorce by the police, uh, other co-workers, investors, something like that. Somebody going to get backed into a corner cancer and they're going to tell everything, G, and you're going to hear about it. Okay? In September. Damn. Ooh, Cancer. Well, that's been your reading, G. Like I said, it may or may not have resonated with every single Cancer. Let me see. Anything else you should be watching or checking? Nope. Still, thank you for visiting my channel. Am I tripping or not tarot? My name is Cock Frost, but you can call me the ghetto nun. Please hit like, subscribe, share with your friends. Again, info for private readings will be below the video. You can purchase your DU gear and your tune-in deck at theghetto nun.com. And I will talk to you later. Love you. Bye.